What's up guys, how you doing? Lord here, and today I'm going to show you how to track the Moab challenge on Modern Warfare 3. It's one of those hidden challenges that don't show up in your barracks or the Elite page, so most people don't know how to track it, or even keep track of their progress in it. Well, I have a very simple solution to that. It's actually very easy to do. First thing you guys are going to need is the Google Chrome browser. You can do it on the other browsers, but it is more difficult to navigate. The concept is the same, so you can try it if you want, but I think it would be a lot easier to just download Chrome if you don't have it already. And once you track the challenge, it won't matter what browser you use to look at it. It will always be there. So to start off, open up Google Chrome and log into your Call of Duty Elite page. Once you're logged in, click on your Modern Warfare 3 player card. From here, you can either scroll down to your challenges or click on the challenges tab on the right hand of the screen. As you can see, I don't have any track challenges right now, so we're going to add the Moab challenge to my track challenges so I can check my progress anytime I want. Click on basic training. We're going to temporarily change the code of one of these challenges. Vandalism actually looks like an easier one to do. So all you have to do is right click anywhere on the screen and click on inspect element. A box will show up at the bottom of the screen. Now I know it looks like a lot of stuff but don't worry this is going to be fairly easy. And if you do end up making a mistake all you need to do is reload your Modern Warfare 3 player card and repeat the steps from there there won't be any permanent damage. Go to the search box on the right hand side and type the word vandalism. Your search will be highlighted in the elements. Now the first one that shows up is the one that you want to alter. Click on the little arrow to the left of it to expand it and show the subcode. So now CH vandalism will be on your screen twice. By the way CH just stands for challenge. So from here just right click on the second CH vandalism and click on edit attribute. Change the word vandalism to the word nuke and press enter. So it should look like this. That was pretty easy, right? Now we're just going to do the same thing to the line above it. Right click on the word vandalism, click on edit attribute, change the word vandalism to nuke and click enter. Now you can close the element box, and the final step is to click on the track challenge button next to the vandalism challenge. The code that is sent through the internet to Elite is now actually the tracking button for the Moab challenge. That's it, you're done. Anytime you want to look at your progress on the Moab challenge, just click on the track challenges and it will be listed on any browser. You can even look at your track challenges from the Call of Duty Elite mobile app on your smartphone. Keep in mind that this challenge will reset every time that you prestige. If anybody has any questions or maybe you think you made a mistake, I'm happy to walk you through the whole process step by step. Just don't be afraid to ask any questions. I'll help out anybody that I can. Even if you're not a subscriber, I'll still help you. And I'll leave a list of the steps in the description just in case you need it. Well guys, I hope this video helps you out. And if you found it useful, please give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed already, I'd appreciate that too. Well, I'll see you guys next time.